If you don't like boring engineering lectures but still want to ace your exams, then this video is for you. Pelton turbines need to stay in control when power demands change. So, how do they do it? There are three main tricks up their sleeves. First, we have spears or needle valve governing. Think of it like turning the tap to control water flow. A needle moves inside the nozzle, adjusting the water jet that hits the turbine buckets. Next up, deflector plate governing. Imagine waving your hand in front of a water hose to redirect the flow. The deflector plate diverts the water away from the buckets, giving a quick response to sudden changes. Then, there's double regulation. This method combines both the spear and the deflector. The deflector acts fast, and the spear fine-tunes the flow for steady control. Lastly, some systems use a bypass valve. This valve diverts extra water safely away, preventing water hammer. These governing methods keep Pelton turbines running smoothly and efficiently, even when the power demand changes. Cool, right? That's turbine tech made simple. 